Hello guys, this is Rico from The Art of War, www.taow.net. Today we're going to do a video tutorial on how to open your router port to allow you to host games. This tutorial is fairly simple to follow. Um, there is, people do usually get confused, so we're just going to go step by step. The first thing you need to go do is go to your router and look up the make and the model for our router that we're going to test today. It's going to be Linksys is the make and the model is WRT54GS. The second, the second thing you're going to need is to look up your router IP for your specific computer and the default gateway. To do that we're just going to click start, click run, and we're just going to enter CMD for command. This is going to open up a black window such as this. And we're just going to enter IP config. This is going to give us our IP address for our computer and the default gateway. We're just going to go ahead and copy those down. IP address. And then we can go ahead and close this. Now, if you can't figure out this number, we can simply get that from going to start, clicking on internet, open up your browser, and we're just going to go ahead and enter the default gateway IP. Copy that, paste that. This is your model number right here. It should match the model number on your router. Now, if you don't know your username or your password, you can look up what the default username and password is. If you already set one and you don't remember it, you would have to press, you have to reset your router manually by going to the back of your router where, where all the connectors are and hold the reset button for 10 seconds, which will reset your router. To look up what the default password and the username is, we're just going to go ahead and cancel this. And we're going to go to a website called www.portforward.com. This is a very great website. It gives you step-by-step -step directions on how to open your ports. We're just doing a video re video review, or sorry, video tutorial to make it simpler. We list a bunch of different routers and their model numbers since ours is a Linksys and our router model is WRT54GS we can copy that and search for it just going to click skip this advertisement and we're just going to select a game in this case we're going to select you can click any one you want in this case we're going to select StarCraft And you're just going to scroll down a little bit, and we're just going to look up this part right here. It says, by default, the username is blank, and the password is admin. Since I have a password already set on my router, I'm just going to go ahead and enter that. And now we're into the router settings right here. In order to open our ports, you have to go through your tabs and figure out where your port opening section is. It's different for every router. Ours is under application and gaming. This is the area where you open your ports. For application, you're just going to enter StarCraft. The port for StarCraft is 6112. I'm just going to enter that. And the protocol is both TCP and UDP. So I'm just going to go ahead and select both. For this number right here, we're going to open up the other IP address that we saved. This is the IP address of your computer that your router has given you. So we can go ahead and copy that and paste that there. I'm just going to enable this port to be open and we're just going to save settings. 
No, the settings are saved for this IP address only. If you restart your computer, this IP address may change. For your for your specific computer, you would have to come back in here and change this IP address. Also, we suggest that you change the password to your router since people can access it and they can change everything around for you and mess up your settings so it's for security purposes you just have to go into administration and just enter a router password you can just go ahead and close this we don't need it anymore our port is opened now in order to in order to check your port to see if it is open you can do one of two things you can either log into the game and try to create or host the game and see if anyone can join or you can just scroll down and go to this website I believe I have no I don't cancel it's this website right here and we're just going to go in there and we're just going to go down and click download our PF port check program. We're just going to go ahead and save the file and we're just going to run the file. Just install this small application and you don't want to add any toolbars and install. And we're just going to click finish close this, close this browser, minimize this, and this is the program right here, just going to double click it, and we're just going to enter the port that we opened, since it was 6112, we're going to check TCP first, and it will say your port is open, we're going to go ahead and check UDP as well, and it should say the same thing, this is just the way to check if your port is open, and that is it. That is all to opening your port. And if you have any questions, please contact me on www.taow.net. And I hope you find this tutorial very helpful. Thank you. Bye.